Sleep paralysis is not bad for you. It's actually the moment you are leaving your body. That's not true. I've never experienced sleep paralysis in the process of leaving my body. Sleep paralysis is usually something that is messing with you. In my opinion, in all the times I experienced sleep paralysis, I literally was like frozen and I couldn't move. And the harder I tried, the harder it was to get out. And anybody who's gotten sleep paralysis will tell you that. It's an opportunity for you to overcome fear. That's what it is. Because I got so strong in that inner realm and doing all this stuff, these things would mess with me in other ways. Like they try to find new ways to mess with me personally i experienced sleep paralysis where i left my body and the common one that of returning to the body here is how i see it we have different type of bodies you have your etheric body your astral body just to name a few so when you are in a deep sleep your brain shuts down motor neurons so you don't act out your dreams so in sleep paralysis your mind wakes up while your body is in a state of paralysis remember in a dream state your third eye taps into the subtle realities that we can't see with our two eyes Sometimes you might feel like you can't breathe, but remember that breathing is different from a wakeful state and a sleep state. In a sleepful state, we have shallow breaths. This is more like you as a soul, you're in a state of between realms where you are neither sleeping nor awake and you are consciously aware of it. And usually uh, you panic because the body cannot move and then you fear this and you tap into your lower chakras which deal with survival Then you eventually just come back to your physical reality. But when you don't fear this phenomena, and observe it, you could use it as an opportunity to tap into other states like astral projection. So from my experience, don't fear it. Instead, utilize it for your own benefit.